Welcome to this series where we are building up a transport empire in Transport Fever 2. In the last part, we advanced the date to 1950 and got access to the large airports. And in that video, we were laying out our air infrastructure that will last us right through to 2020. The only airport that's currently missing that will come later on is over in Polgate here. And at the moment, I haven't quite decided what I want to use it for. We've got oil here, which will probably be used for fuel. So at the moment, I've just left this space here. Now, what I want to do in this part is start working on upgrading my main backbone for goods, which is coming down here. It's going to be a very big project. I doubt if I'm going to finish it in this video. But before that, I need to do a couple of things which I've noticed. First one is over here. At the moment we've still got some vintage ships running our uh, grain line and what I want to do is replace all these with the new ships we got in the 1950s this one these carry more and the plus they've got four compartments which is something I want to explore going forward because we may be having to ship more materials along this route so to replace you oops okay. Okay. review a bit of a fail there but never mind we'll just yeah oops still couldn't do that one um, just replace you as well that should give me three ships running there now the next problem is here i mean this is quite a key supply line you can see the oil's all piled up here and i've got an old dirt road here which needs to be upgraded and I also need to upgrade the truck so let's get this in here and, I mean this is an 80 kilometer road so I think this will stand us in good stead until such time as we got the higher speed trucks and what I want to do is replace these with dedicated uh, tanker trucks the moment we're running these they're only 30 miles an hour or kilometers an hour all I want to do is replace them with these 60 kilometer diesel trucks that are actually car dedicated to carrying a fuel and what I want to do now is upgrade the silver line to the point where we can actually get more goods flowing in so, but the first thing I want to do is actually upgrade these stations so we're going to let this silver train get out of the way And the moment I've got this single line here, I don't know why I actually double track this all the way in, but we'll be fixing that as we go forward. Just let them get a long way away. That was the pause. I'm just going to get rid of this section here. There. Oops. And then what I want to do is I'm just going to extend the platforms out. This should take it to the maximum size. I mean, we could go bigger. I can't really see the point, to be honest. I'm just going to upgrade you like that. And what this should do is take us to the, the full 320. Give us a yep. I think 320 would be more than adequate. And of course, what we're gonna have to do is come here, tracks, upgrade. Why didn't you upgrade? I think you've got the We've now got this line laid in here um, just to make everybody happy we're gonna ah, collision great thank you game yeah we just got to let the I mean I'm gonna re be replacing this anyway so we get this laid in there 
and then we're gonna run you. I'll probably have to rework this, but game, stop messing about. Get you, you hooked into there for the moment. And what we're going to have to do is, I don't think I actually need that section of track here, because the silver trains go down that way. I'm just going to take out that little bit there. That gives me the main structure here for the silver trains. They should all be running really well. Next thing I want to do is get. Now, this one's going to be a bit more complicated to put in. And so, what I want to do is get that train away. Oh, we've got two trains here. Ah. Okay, let's just go up to. Where are you? Right, so let's just go up to this one. Okay, the station's there. I'm just going to have a quick pull. And what I should be able to do is a straight upgrade here. This one looks like it might be the full size already. Or is it just me being... Oh, no, it's the effect of the uh, terminal here. So let's just delete you. Now we're going to delete configure platforms. Yeah. I'll go platform. Okay. Just looked a bit bigger than before. going to uh, track there and we'll just, uh, oops hook you up like that and then just make this complete this line here we've now got the high-speed track into here we've got the full length uh, platform here mm. how many trains have I actually got on this line probably a few too many so I think we're just gonna sell you for the moment I want to put the station on this side, aiming that way, so that we can take the track up through here, because this will have its own completely separate track. So what we're going to do is come here. Um, in a lot of lag now. there and what I'm thinking is we're going to be aiming roughly in that direction there like that actually I can keep I can let the trains keep running while I build this a bit of a failure on my part there um, I think we're going to go with one of these and the game will discover us I think we're going to go with a normal station 320. Um, I'm going to just stick you out a little bit like that. I'm just 
my view back about here. Of course, I've put to do that because I'm getting fed up having to upgrade the track all the time. Now got this cantilever track here. Now the next bit's going to be quite fun because what I need to do is replace this viaduct here. I need no trains on it whilst I'm actually doing it. And what we're going to have to do? Oops, just missed that opportunity there. What we're going to do is let the this train get over it, and then let you get clear. Pause. because one of the problems with these bridges is you can't upgrade them if you can upgrade the track on the bridge but you can't actually upgrade the track so and then get out Of course, what we're going to do is go to the bridge there because that will give me 180. I'm just going to connect you up to there. And of course, we'll run the game can quite happily carry on running. And what I want to do now is we're going to pick up a tr what's the so we're going to be coming in from about there through here we're going to hit these tracks about somewhere about here and if I let's just run you you still on afford to run past so play that track in like that no don't want you like that and then what I'm gonna do is put uh, another track alongside that will give me the four tracks that will run this way I think we can come off this curve like that now, as long as the, this high-speed track stays over 180, I'll be happy because this is going to be a goods track. So it's not like it's going to be. I mean, I want to keep it reasonably tidy. So you know, if we come to out there, and we got a little bit of a dent there. Yeah, I think we can. Oh, no, I don't want that. I want to go down in that dent dip. Like that, I want to fly over. Uh, nope, cancel. I think this track is pinning this in position. So we're just gonna let this track get try and get out of the way. Get you let you get over the top of that hill. And we're just going to pause the whole lot. I want to get rid of this dip in the track here. So what we're gonna have to do is probably leak you. James gonna complain like heck, but Right back here. 
we have to change this line as well. Come back here. So you're now being on an embankment running to there. So just take that bit out. And I've got piles of cash, so it's not like I'm going to be broke. And that's the wrong track. up the wrong, wrong, wrong track. You have to hook up to there. And you have to come out of there and run all the way through. Construction not possible. Why have we got a collision here? Oh, there's a dinky little bit of track left in there. You. And we're going to run you into there. And got that bit there. And I think what we're going to do is get rid of this road here, get rid of the crossing, and Delete this bit like that. Oops, I've got a train coming off of here. Uh, this is probably not so view up there and add two hundred and forty. And I think you can sweep we've been about there on the high speed track and I'll probably rework this as part of repairing this whole line here but I guess we'll do while I'm for the moment we've now got this track running through to here and what I'm going to do now is just run you are you indulging in a collision? Why are you colliding? Ah, I think you've you're on the wrong curve now, aren't you? Oops, also save going through. Yeah, the tracks are narrowing here. Just gonna put you back and I'm gonna run you alongside this line. 300 kilometers an hour. And we're just gonna run you about there. And what we're gonna do is quite literally run you straight across the track line like this it's 300 kilometers all the way into this station here and where's the missing line there it is across here of course I've been deleting signals so that some of the one has been got one game run into there 
124 that'd be quite nice now the next problem is I've now got to switch we've got this track running all the way through to here and what I want to do now is run I'd love to straighten this section of track up now this is like a, a little bit of a dog leg <laughs> it's going to be a bit more tricky I think what we might be able to do is use this track as a you out there and then we're going to run you mm. I want this kind of curving around like this is a little bit no take track integrity there is no good so, what I'm going to do is run you this again and I'm just gonna pause and you may have to be <laughs> removed here and what I'm going to do now is run you through now you're still dog legging just take you off here as well we got a track dead straight from here Track to run, which did straight. Yeah, 300 kilometers an hour, 300. And I want you to curve around a little bit like that, and you're a too much slope. And I want you to come in. this bit in this and get you there and I want you into there like that okay. I'm gonna let this run forward this train should be quite happy to go and pick up its track there. And what I want to do now is we got a line there. And what we need to do is get a line out of here. We've got nothing coming up this track, so I'm just gonna pause again. Take this line out here, like that, and then what I want to do now is curve a line round up to here. So I want to start about here. And let's maybe start. Leap. 
you there. And we're gonna run out from here. In a, on a curve like that, 175 would be good enough. Uh, 300. Maybe uh, a little bit tighter on the curve, 260. Like that. Yeah. 20 to 30. 208, 208. Uh, I think 190 will be adequate. And I want you to effectively curve in like that. And then I want you to run down line here and your job is going to be connected there so we'll have that line running there now this is going to be the up line and what we have to do now is just do that and for the moment we're just going to hook in a temporary track there. And see on scene. Now the reason for that is that this doesn't have a link, but we can fix that with the crossover here. Much like we can do it just here that that will cherry one up and get them running we've still got the line integrity now right you've left that way and what I'd like to do now is move you from Hornsey exchange there and connect all stations. Uh, we can't connect lower beauty for the moment. Again, we'll just have to fudge this a little bit for the moment. This is the downline, so we should be able to that to there. That means I should be able to remove this from the equation while I'm looking at it. Thank you, Auto Save. Check out this section. that out. We've now got a high-speed track running from here all the way up through here and it's completely self-contained with the crossovers. Let's operate that section of track there. Of course I've deleted all the signals so signals back in with the downline so we're going to be the upline so at the moment we've got this line feeding into here which is then coming up to there Now the next thing I need to do is connect this up properly with this line here, get rid of these wire ducts. What we have to do is make sure there's no trains on 
this section. Mm -hmm. Let you get all out of that section. Oh, great. Wait, what are you doing? Problem here is I've deleted some of the signals, so. signals back in here so that everything looks good and of course what I need to do now is just bring up this track here I think that's far enough for the moment Just gonna pause now. I think you're just about to come onto this line here. No, this is the bit next bit I want to replace. Bring you back here. Get rid of you. A little bit of track. all the way back to the new line here okay. we're gonna come off of here I think this is good I think we're gonna here we can stay over 200 books and what I wanted to do is go down move back a bit like that and What we're going to do is go underground here. Um, get any heart? No, I don't want you to break the surface. So, so track speed there is. What was that? Twenty nine one eight six. Probably a bit too sharp. And get you back to about 200 that'd be good and you well, one more now you're above ground I want you to stay below ground for the moment and then we're going to come through here and I want you to ah, super deep cutting here I think that will work 214 um late eight might need to be about there maybe i need to bring you up a smidge out of that cutting i was hoping to keep the tunnel all the way through so maybe we'll just make that cutting a little bit deeper because we're going to break through here anyway we pull you back oh, interfere with the bridge structure now oh great thank you again okay. and cancel Good. This out. And start again. Get you is going to be good. We're 
That's 205. That's 210. Wait, what are you hooking up that? You're curving round like that. I think we'll go with that. Um, and get you hopefully close to the surface. That's 255 running through to there. And probably as well right under that viaduct. Okay, I didn't really want to do this, but I'm oh, sorry, you've got to go. that little bit of track there we can curve you right round to make that function as a collision Okay, we'll just have to trim this off. And then we're going to have to hook up again. And then we're going to run new right round. It's the speed 300, 300, 295, 290. That gives me a completely underground tunnel here. Yep, I'm gonna be happy with that. And then, oh. <laughs> and then, and it's just let trains run. Use the unhappy trains. Lower beauty. I know Lower, Lower Buesley doesn't have a connection. What's up with you? What's up with you? Why can't you get rolling? Okay. Have to sell you as well. Sorry. Basically, he was stuck in that section because this section was being shared. I know you've got no connection, but you will have one soon. Yeah, I'm just going to come out here. Water save going through. And run you underground. It's going to get a little bit messy. Now can you go up to the surface? If you come to the surface there. Um, wow, you're way too high. Um, you can run over ground there. Eight two slow. Take you to two fourteen there. I'm just gonna take this line out here. tunnel there. I want you running virtually all the way under there and get you in a bit of a closer curve like 
that. Help, how high can we get you? Another level up. Another one. We'll bring you to here. You're now above ground. Let's curve you. Ugh. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Doing game. What I'd like to do is get you up to there with that. Track upgrade. So, why are you not connected? got the track finally sorted out so what we've effectively got now is a one-way track with trains running from here the trains are now running up from here to here and what I could probably do is try and delete this cross track here This game sometimes. So I hope you do that. I put another cross track in up here somewhere. Need to upgrade that. Um, and a little bit of slow track in there. There. So this is now running really, really well. I need to do a now. I'll, I'll, sig I'll signal it up off camera. Tiny little bit of difference in height there. I'm sure there was another crossover track in here somewhere. I put in. Just have a quick run down. Nope. Obviously not. Now, this is the upline. So what I need to do now is just get to about here. And I just want to put in a small piece of crossover track here between here and here because that will allow me to add new trains to this line we've now got this running um. I'm gonna find the trains now <laughs> Oops, nope. Manage vehicles. And I'm going to do is edit these now. Right, I think just to wind this part up, just go in here. Edit manage vehicles. You and we're going to place you with some new trains we're going to go and stick with electric these are 516 I mean these are still 
probably one of the better trains we've got 120 this is a this is faster it's got less tractive ethic i think we're going to stick with these this so i'm going to replace you now cargo wise at the moment we've got 11 gondolas and six flat cars and what we want is one two three five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so that gives me capacity of 18 12 of 18 and what we really need now is one two three four five six and seven we'll go with that and see how it works what we'll do is clone in an extra as well and what we've got to do now is find a train on the line just to see how well it's performing i think it might be a bit long right we're going to need to signal this now save you can be very inspiring sometimes used to doing this as the downline. I'm just going to put you in there. You there. On there. you I know you're gonna be completely underground we won't go through the tunnel so we're running at 102 kilometers now 103 and um, just coming in here let's see how well this is loading Picking up a full 216, that's great. And let's go back to first. And we're going to need a more powerful locomotive on this, I think. I mean, we're not really accelerating through the trees. Apologies for this. And we're up to 70. I mean, we should get to 120 if this line runs well. Yeah, there's a bit of a gap under the bridge there. 1995, 97, 100 kilometers. Getting there. I'm just about to break out here. So we slowed down on the uphill. I might, I might rework that in the a little bit later. So we lost a lot of speed on that uphill grade there. It was probably a bit too steep. Yeah, I mean, it's taken us a long time to get the momentum back up again. Maybe I should have made this a diesel line. Oh, 
We're nearly back up to 120, but we're nearly at the station. How much he's going to pick up? Yeah, 108 returns. So we bring in 216, and we're taking back 108. That would be perfect. Right. I'm very happy with that. It's just I need to rework this little bit here. You can see the the bump here. That's terrible. Anyway, I'm going to do that off camera. So this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming. Oh, we just got ourselves a new tram.